Um, uh, I think she's <coughs> talking as the typical opposition. President Uru Mugai Kenyatta has gone to Uganda as the president of the Republic of <coughs> fully funded by the taxpayers of the Republic of Kenya. So he has gone 100% to pursue the interest of Kenyans. That is number one. Security. Fighting terrorism. We are all fighting in Somali and local and regional. That is priority number one. Number two is trade. In balance of trade, I see a lot of Lugazi sugar in our markets here, affecting mice on the sugar. And other areas of uh, smuggling is going to address that. Three free movement of people. And then peace in the region, South Sudan, here, around. So things like talking on behalf of the position, maybe me, uh, uh, give that to Honorable Raila Dinga or your party leader Kalonzo Busioka to go and advise the opposition. Otherwise, President Uhuru is there as our president. And if he went there to advise the opposition or talk on their behalf, it would be out of order. And I can assure you, our president would not make Why those would it be mistakes. out of order to talk about the importance of democracy and to allow that to thrive and not to clamp down on that space? Now, let me tell you, importance of democracy, <coughs> as a president, there is what we call internal interference. You saw President Obama came here. <coughs> he was prodded by uh, the opposition to come and talk about, and he told him in the face, support your government, work hard, and uh, if necessary, retire. I do not think President Uru has gone there as a regional prefect. He's gone there as a president of Kenya, prime and willing to serve our interests. So the opposition, they can do their game. The way our local opposition do their games here. If they lose, they claim they have lost and they have been robbed of victory. Too